welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Cameron and I'm very sad to say but this will be my last ever college video that I film at UIS which is really 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 crazy to say all my videos after this will be literally moving on with my internship that I have this upcoming spring which you did if you didn't know I'm going to be a strategic marketing partnerships and promotions intern for Disney LSU's creative group next semester and I will be relocating to Celebration Florida to do it and I'm super excited if you don't count my graduation vlog um, this is my very last video that I'm filming as a UIS student which is really crazy to say and as you can tell by the title of today's video today I'm going to be filming my final college move out vlog of my undergraduate career. I'm, if you didn't know, I lived this past semester with three other roommates, Faith, Amani, and Lisette, um, in a four bedroom apartment. And um, it's been quite the experience. I have definitely have enjoyed my room and um, living with uh, my roommates um, and I'm just really really surprised that it went by this fast. I distinctly remember moving into this room almost four months ago. Um, I actually documented the um, move-in day for my senior year in August. I did a whole vlog on it. Definitely go watch that if you would like. It's called College Move-In Day 2022 Senior Year. Um, but we have now come full circle and I'm literally about to move right back out of this room. Um, so with that being said, I have a lot that I need to pack. Um, I have not really packed anything just because I've wanted to live somewhat comfortably in my room um, for the past week and a half that I've been back since um, Thanksgiving break and the day that I'm filming this it was currently Wednesday December 7th. I plan to move out tomorrow morning on Thursday December 8th. My parents plan to get on the road early in the morning tomorrow and should be here about early late afternoon um, meaning I have to be completely packed and ready to go to load the car and head back home to my hometown by tomorrow. So we have a lot to do. If you have been watching my channel over the past couple of years of me documenting my college experience here at UIS, you know that this is a tradition that I do on my channel. I always film my move-in process and my move-out process and just expect a lot of time lapses. I'm going to be updating you guys along the way of everything that I'm packing. I have a whole list of things that I need to dock and check off, but it's very bittersweet. I think the, the toughest part for me is going to be taking my decorations down just because I was a little bit late to the game and putting up decorations in my room just because I was like really really busy and just traveling and coming in and out of my room and the apartment with just events and everything so I really kind of put it off to like the first week of October and I've only really had to enjoy having these decorations up for like a month and a half which is really you know it is what it is but I'm literally about to be moving into a whole other apartment in a whole other state in less than a month so I'm not really complaining I'm very excited um, and definitely stay tuned for that next chapter because you guys already know I'm going to be documenting my entire time while I'm in Florida for the next six months doing this really exciting internship but enough rambling it is currently 4.53 the sun is about to set, it's getting dark, and I have between now and tomorrow morning to completely pack up everything that I have on this campus and go home for winter break and for the school year. So let's get started. Hello everyone, we're back. So this would happen on my last night here at UIS of all days for this to happen. Nothing bad happened, but I just think it's funny and I'm laughing about it now. There was just a fire alarm that just went off in the living community that I live in and <laughs> I like ran out. I like grabbed my coat and my phone and my AirPods and my keys and I like ran out to the front of my apartment with like pretty much everyone else that lives in my area and we were all kind of just standing around waiting for the fire truck to come, waiting for the police to come. The residence director had to come out and figure out what was going on. He was like banging on people's doors, trying to figure out who set the fire alarm off. And it was a couple apartments down from where my apartment is. I guess someone 
was cooking something. It was like one of those mini um, easily things that sets the fire alarm off. I don't, I honestly don't know what it is, but all I know is that everyone is safe. They told us the okay to go back. So I literally just came back to my, my room. So I just think it's funny of all days and of all times for the fire alarm to go off. Of course, it's my last night where it goes off. So this is going to be fun to look back on in the future and remember, but I just wanted to come on here to state that. Um, but yeah, I am now going to get back into packing. I was actually, before the fire alarm went off, I was actually going through my to-do list and checking off everything that needs to be um, done. I was just looking through to see what exactly um, I want to do so we have that ready to go and yeah I'm just going to organize a little bit and I'll be able to do, I cannot talk and I'll be doing some time lapses of me packing up my room. I think I'm gonna start with my room decor so stay tuned. Alright, hello guys. A little update. As I was packing up my room, I found this on my door. This is the little um, sticker icon that the RA for my apartment area gave us at the beginning of the year. Um, it's like little popsicles. I had a chocolate popsicle as my name. It doesn't really matter because I'm leaving my room, but I was in room 125A, so it just has that here. So. This is going to go in my scrapbook when I make my scrapbook for um, my senior year. Um, hopefully sometime in the next couple of weeks. So I thought I'd show you guys this, this little memento of moving out of my room. But without further ado, we're going to get back into packing.
is a lot later since the last time I've updated you. It is now almost midnight. It is 11.57. I have been packing for almost, I think, seven hours straight. I'm trying to think. I started packing at like 4.50 so we can round that to 5 o'clock. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 12. I've been packing for seven hours straight and I'm happy to say that everything is pretty much ready to go. Um, I think the only thing I have to do in the morning when I wake up is pack my LED lights, pack my bedding, pack my bathroom stuff because I do plan to shower and everything, um, pack my rug on my floor, um, pack the microwave and my breeder filter that's drying out in the kitchen and then pack my cart and then leave and I've already filled out the official checkout information this is actually the envelope that I'm going to that I'm going to be turning into ResLife tomorrow to officially check out of my room as well as turn in my keys so yep we are officially done this is my last night that I will ever spend at UIS which is really crazy to say I will probably never in my life after tonight spend the night on campus at UIS as a student which is wow very 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 crazy so the next time I will be here I will be graduating college which is very very crazy so Good things are to come. That's the update. I'm honestly, it is now 11.59. I'm going to shower and go to bed. My parents plan to be here around late morning tomorrow, so I'm going to have plenty of time to load my car, pack everything else up in my room, in the bathroom, in the kitchen, and other things that are around the apartment, and leave and go home for winter break and go home for the school year, which is exciting. So. That is going to be it for now. I'm not exactly sure when you guys will see me again. I feel like I'm going to be too frantically hectic packing up and leaving Springfield to update and vlog tomorrow. And I think by the time I get to my house, I'm probably going to just go to bed and just call the day. So I may update you guys on Friday. We'll see, but that's the update for now, and I'll talk to you guys later. Just want to take a moment my room is completely empty it's the way I found it in August and we are leaving it the same way I literally have packed up my whole room in the span of 24 hours yay me everything is outside my parents will be here any minute I'm about to turn in my keys and say goodbye to this chapter all my paperwork is done I just vacuum so I won't get charged for not having a clean area. Nothing's damaged. We're good to go. I'm gonna take a couple of final pictures for the thumbnail and we will head out. Bathroom is completely gone. We got everything that's mine. Kitchen. Is all done. You guys know all my appliances were here, so that is all cleaned off. All my drawers, these are the drawers that I use. Completely empty. Everything is out of the fridge freezer. I used this half of the cabinet, and that is all empty. And then everything else is my roommates. Put a couple things in the trash, and we are good to head out. I'm gonna lock my door and we can go. Goodbye room, you've been good. Closing this chapter.
Goodbye, senior year apartment. All right, everyone, this is it. This is all my stuff. That's gonna be going in my mom's car. My car is fully packed. I literally just closed my door for the last time to my apartment and it's really sad. But I'm literally about to turn in my keys and we're about to head out, so. All right, guys, this is everything. Everything is all packed. I just walked out of my apartment for the very last time. I locked my room, so my room is locked. I have my keys ready to turn in. Now I just gotta wait for my dad to come. Alright guys, while we have some time here before my parents come, they're about 30 minutes out. I honestly want to come on here and just do a quick little just talk and recap and honestly just closing this chapter. Um, these are the final few minutes that I will be on UIS campus as a student when i come back here i will be a college graduate which is very crazy i cannot believe that i just moved out of my senior year of college apartment and i'm about to close this chapter and enter empty empty enter a new fun exciting one and just to get things started you guys know i cannot be more excited to start my internship in the spring um I'm so happy I got to talk to um, my friend Lisette um, the last time um, before I leave because um, she actually is not leaving until Saturday. It's currently Thursday, so she's going to be here for like one more day because she has a final today. And I believe she has something on Friday, but she's leaving Saturday morning, so it's literally just going to be one day. And Faith actually left on Tuesday, so we're kind of leaving a day after each other, so it's not like... We're going to be by ourselves for that long. Um, but I'm so happy I got to talk to her. Um, unfortunately, um, I haven't really just really, I, I really just, it still hasn't sunken into me that I am leaving UIS for the very last time as a student. I, I really am very bittersweet right now. I am just overwhelmed. I've been reflecting this whole week on my whole chapter here at UIS, and man oh man, has it been quite the chapter. Um, I cannot wait to do a debrief slash recap slash just like college look back of everything in like 10 years from now just to remember this time my year my years at UIS not even to get sentimental have literally changed my life. I have met some of my best friends that I will be friends with forever um, that are my friends for life and also um, was able to join my um... anyways there's someone walking by my car I didn't want them to see me talking to the camera anyways we're getting better at it also I apologize uh, it's that time of the month I'm breaking out please excuse my pimples and everything we're, we're, we're getting the face back together you know stress finals you, your face just does things I think most of these are stress pimples so don't mind me it's that time we're gonna be doing a whole skincare regimen when we get home um, but I literally could not even exaggerate by saying that my past three and a half years I guess you can say not really four because I'm not going to be here next semester but the past three and a half years at UIS have literally changed my life the connections that I've made um, friends that I've made for life that I will literally talk to for the rest of my life that I just cannot wait to see what they do in the future vice versa with me going off doing really amazing things following my dreams working at my dream company. Um, I really am just appreciative of all of my professors um, that 
uh, ended up being just really awesome people in my life that have really helped me out and supported me and motivated me. I also want to give a shout out to the UIS Career Center. I don't know if anyone is watching um, from the UIS Career Center with this video, but if you are, I'm very grateful for you guys too. Shout out to Angie as well as um, Kathy. You guys are awesome and I will definitely keep in touch with you guys. You guys are the best bosses I've had. Um, not even exaggerating i love them so much um, and they've been just a big help in my development as a uh, person and just growing into a better version of myself um, i want to give a special shout out to my two ride or, ride or die best friends at uis that have been with me since the beginning faith metellus and lisette um, Cortez, you guys are awesome. You guys are the reason why my experience at UIS has been awesome. And I cannot wait for our future endeavors. We're planning to do a lot of really exciting things in the future. We literally have an Apple note going of all the places we want to travel to, all the experiences we want to do. They're literally like my ride or die best friends they're gonna be bridesmaids in my wedding like the whole nine yards like they're literally gonna be in every next chapter of my life and i cannot wait to um just continue doing life with them um and i also want to give a shout out to my delta sisters as well especially uh, my delta sisters that i worked with this past school year even though it was only first semester um, the bond that we created all of the really fun events that we had i'm very very proud honestly of the impact that i left on my delta chapter this year um, and that i'm leaving going off um, and to uh, graduating and everything i really enjoyed all the events that we put on this semester and i'm just very proud of the job that i did and the impact that i hopefully made on some students on campus um, and i just cannot wait to see what the future holds for them and just in general everyone that i have not mentioned um, that will I guess be mentioned generally like this. Um, I am truly appreciate I'm truly appreciative for every single one of you also watching this video right now. Comment below if you've been here since my freshman year of college when I moved into UIS for my freshman year. If you are still here watching my channel, wow, wow, you are dedicated, you are committed, you are a real one and you get a gold star um, because you guys have literally watched me grow up in this chapter and as this chapter closes and i go into a next chapter i cannot wait to continue to bring you guys along with me um, but yeah i know that was very deep and i know that was very reflective but that's honestly how i'm feeling right now i feel like I'm probably going to get more emotional about it later this week and weekend when I really think about it more. Um, but lots of updates are to come, you guys. I have so much that I cannot wait to share with you guys that are currently in the works, that is coming up in the future. I'm obviously going to keep you guys updated with this internship and just that whole process of relocating to Central Florida, moving into a new place, meeting my new roommate, starting a new job, literally the whole nine yards. It's going to be very, very fun. And I cannot wait to bring you guys along with me. And with that, I cannot believe I'm saying these words right now. That is going to be it for today's video. This concludes my chapter at UIS. To future Cameron watching this in 10, 15 years from now, we did that. We did that. We completed a bachelor's degree in college. We are graduating in May. We are about to start this next exciting chapter with Disney, and we did that. So I cannot wait to see what we are doing in the future. Obviously, you know, because you're watching me 10 years in the future, but I cannot wait to see where we're at. I know it's going to be great. So that's going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video.